So I think there's two elements to that. On the design and development, you know, technologies have moved on. We now live in a virtual world, CAD, 3D, virtual realization for parts. And that, that enables us to design things quickly, transfer the designs to our customer and get approval of the design before we've actually even manufactured any parts. So there's huge streamlining there of efficiencies. The second side is customer service. And there's no doubt we've moved into a digital age. A lot more of the ordering and customer requirements are online, not just for ordering, but also knowledge. You know, what is the part? What are the tolerances? How should it be used? What can the material do? What can't it do? All that now needs to be digital online. And fundamentally, it gives them quicker access to, to knowledge. And that's what this modern day needs. So design, very much improving, driving efficiency. But customer service is about delivering the right information at the right time to give efficiency both to us and to the customer. I don't think there's one specific technology that really makes the, the big difference. I think it is more a combination of a lot of technologies. So taking it through the supply chain, simple things like EDI, where we can take customer orders electronically straight into the system, no longer needing for purchase orders. That's changed the front end of the business. The design and development side, you can now do virtual copies, carbon copies, digital copies of products to get customers agreement and buy-in before you even manufacture it. And then you push through into the factory where you have the smart factories, efficiencies in production, right through to delivery of parts, on-time delivery, guarantee, so customers can track and know where orders are. So I think it's a combination of combining the technologies that is really driving efficiency and giving both us as a business and customers benefits. All parts of the company and industry have been affected by Industry 4.0. It's a journey, it's one which will continue. Taking design as an element, we now have virtual parts, we can virtually simulate, we can determine what may happen out in production before we even produce the part. Right through to the factory, how we schedule things, this is all digital nowadays to guarantee that you've got the most efficient mix, the most effective solution before it even hits the shop floor. So it's a combination of throughput of technologies that makes a difference. Industry 4.0 isn't a new thing, it's a journey that's been going on for a number of years. In true sense, most of it is customer driven. Customers are demanding more of us. You know, it may not just be the simple part, it may be the packaging requirements, the documentation pack, or tertiary items that are important to them. That's forcing us to look at our systems, to streamline, to drive efficiency, to give the customer what they want, when they want it, in an efficient manner. There's no doubt data has had a huge impact on the industry and on the business. You know, the old saying, data, knowledge is power, is very, very true. From the product development side, you know, we're harnessing all the legacy designs that we've done, the items that we've done, and using that knowledge when a customer comes with a new proposition, a new idea, we can leverage old designs and work out what will work to make sure we've got it most efficient, not only in the design side, but also from the manufacturing, so the design for manufacture can be considered in a digital age. We can communicate with the customer much more efficiently, giving them samples. We can provide them 3D printed items so they can actually check functionality of the part before a mold tool or even components are produced. So there's significant improvements there. It's not only that, but the industry as a whole is driving far more from us. They demand, you know, not only the parts, but documentation pack, quality information, how the part is packaged. All that can be now centralised, pushed through systems to drive efficiency. And efficiency at the end of the day gives us benefits as a business, but also the end customer.